everybody, we are back again, and today we're gonna to talk about the top three yoga moves, not yoga stretches, that you're gonna do for outfielders. Okay, we're gonna get right to it. All you need is a little mem memory bank and put your ears on, give it a listen. I have the timer all ready for you. We're gonna start with two minutes each pose. If you're feeling tired, you can drop it down, but try not to. And if you're feeling really good and you really increase your stamina, you can raise it to three minutes each pose. But it's meant to be a quick, full body warm out, warm up relevant to outfielders. So let's give it a go. We're gonna start standing. I'm gonna strengthen those legs, open up the shoulders, and get some nice support in the back. Starting the timer, I'm gonna bring the arms forward and back, forward and back, that's it. So try to get into a rhythm with your breathing. When the arms go back, stick the chest out. You can change your angles, play around with it. Try to maybe get a clap behind your back. That way I know you're pulling your shoulder blades back. Trying to breathe in and out through the nose. At the same time, building a lot of strength in that thigh area. Write these down, take them to the field with you. You don't need to bring this video all the time. It's pretty easy to memorize. Make it big, make it small, change it up, angle of the arms, maybe palms forward, back. Alternate which way you cross your arms too. Don't just keep always crossing left over right. Almost there. Equal weight in both feet. Watch it the first time. So you can really see what I'm changing up with my hands, the position of my body. It's not easy. It's not easy for me. I'm trying to make it look like it's easy, but it's not. Let's bring it down. So the next one we're gonna do is an alternating lunge with a reach. So a lot of dynamic plays go on in the outfield. You need to have really good range of motion in the shoulders, as well as the inner and outer thigh, front of the leg quads and hamstrings, and strong glutes. So we're gonna set the clock. Make sure you can see me here. And we're gonna go reach and reach. It's not about rushing it, it's about feeling it. So reach the arm like you mean it, not like a T-Rex. Notice my straight leg, toes point up to get the best stretch to keep the knee safe. Try to keep your head in the natural extension of your spine. So keep it in alignment, don't drop your shin down, don't look up and forward. You don't want to strain the neck before you even get on the field. Little pause on the reach. Almost there. I think the outfielders and infielders will benefit from each other's short 
yoga moves video. So check out other ones, not just your position. Finish it up. And bring the legs together and onto the mat. Take a little breath. So next one we're gonna do is a locust raise. Locust pose, raise and lower. You know those diving plays in the outfield when they're, you're in this position? It's gonna accentuate that. We're also gonna put a little bit of a stretch in the arms by interlacing the fingers. This move goes with your breath. So slow and controlled, it's not very big. It's also gonna bring tremendous strength to the back and stretch the front spine, okay? So set the clock, come on to the belly. We're gonna reach the arms out and you're gonna interlace your fingers and press. Inhale up. Exhale down. Don't jam the head up. It's not about your head. It's about a full body move. It's not about lifting your eyes. Let's interlace our fingers the opposite way now. Normally my left pointer is on top. I'm going to switch it up, stretch it out, and continue. If you're super tight in the shoulders and that's unfortunate and you can't interlace and do the move, you could reach until you're ready to connect. in there. Shut that timer down. A lot of back work. Just gonna come back into child's pose. <sighs> Knees wide, big toes touch, arms extend. And that's it. Those are my top three suggestions for yoga moves for outfielders. Check out all the other videos. They may tap into an area that you need some work with, some help on. Check them out and I'll see you next time.